songbird. Maybe he's the reason you're here all the yeah. time. Yeah. Aye, if the bard's got talent, I'll give him that. You just make sure his music is the only thing you're admiring. Oh, John, darling, you know you're the only stone-biting, knuckle-dragging Nord for me. Ah, <laughs> that's my girl. <laughs> Young people. I did not know that those two were an item. Well, I meant to close the door, not knock a pot off a thing. We drink to our youth, today's come and gone. For the age of aggression is just about done. I thought John was a poet, not a singer. Though I suppose if he wants Mikael to sing his songs, that is something. It's not easy being a woman in Skyrim, I know. It's not easy being anyone in Skyrim with this weather. But stay strong, and the men will come to respect you. And maybe even uh, plenty of men fear me at this point. I miss the days when the Grey Manes and Battleborns got along. Ever since the war started. We've been at each other's throats. <laughs> yeah, it might be a good idea to go see about the companions. Yeah. I don't want to go traipsing about. Best defense is a good defense, am I right? I don't want to go traipsing about in the tundra in this weather. Best leave that for later in the in the day. Perhaps when it's warmer. Is those two at it again? Ha, Just get out of here. Go wear them out. Hmm. Nice. Are they always like this? Pull them back. Is this good to see you? Until next time. Good to see you too. Get him. Kill him. There's that kid. Oh, another fight. Should probably go talk to one of them. You're well, there's one grey hair in the lot. I'm staying out of this. As well you might. They're really going at it. I wonder who did what. Going to enjoy killing you. I'll see you. Uh, pardon me. My brother Vilkas is a better talker than me. He should be around someplace. I'm going to assume that the one that looks just like you is your brother. <laughs> uh, can I take you up on the offer? Can I join the companions? You mentioned something about it yesterday. Godlack is the one who figures out who can be a companion. So talk to him. It's out of my hands. Good to know. Until next time. Huh. There are two gray hairs in this place. Though one of them looks more like... He should be the companion's treasurer than an actual companion. I'll see you burn. This should be good. Going to enjoy killing you. Excuse me. Don't mind them. Just working out some issues in the old way. Kill him. Kill him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Weren't expecting that, were you? That's your best. They always like this. You dare fight a Dunmer? Of grief. <laughs> You're pathetic. They just keep going. Jaws, another fight. Must have scared them off. I wonder what's supposed to be there. It's in pieces, whatever it is. Oh look, they're finally done. And this codlack should be down here somewhere. At least I assume he should be down here somewhere. Oh, I'm just a servant, dear. 
You want to talk to one of the companions, I'm sure. Yeah. One in particular. Not now. That. You would not happen to know where Codlack is, would you? Who's in charge around here? You don't just waddle in here and get to speak to the boss. Who do you think you are? If you want to embarrass yourself, I won't stop you. Codlack is the harbinger. He's the closest thing you'll find to a leader around here. Mm-hmm. And good day to you as well. Who are the companions? Are you looking to join? I wouldn't get your hopes up. The short answer is, we fight. The long answer is... Ugh, forget it. You're not worth my time. Mm-hmm. I've been tending to the warriors of your Vasker for as long as I can remember. I hope they treat you better than they treat me. Huh. I also wonder if... How long her memory goes. Sometimes you get up there in age and it just doesn't happen anymore. Uh, there's one of the brothers. I assume that's Kodlak. But I still hear the call of the blood. We all do. It is our burden to bear. But we can overcome. You have my brother and I, obviously. But I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. <laughs> I wonder if they know about that thing that happens. Going berserk. You're Codlack, right? A stranger comes to our hall. I've been told uh who are the companions your question carries more weight than you may know newcomer the sort of thing some of us spend our lives pondering the difference between a noble band of warriors and a ragged bunch of assassins is as thin as a blade's edge i try to hold us to the right path i see I would like to join the Companions if you would have me. I know I'm not much to look at, but, um... Why did you join the Companions? Like most of our band, I found this family after losing my own. I traveled the length and breadth of this land, learning all I could of the sword and the axe. I was just a boy, but I had the fire of a man in my heart. Eventually, my body caught up to my spirit. My predecessor, Askar, found me in Hammerfell. I was serving as a bodyguard for some weak-necked lord out there. He brought me back here, and I realized that I was actually coming home. I worked to bring honor to this family, and to the family that I lost. For my mother, my father, and my grandfather. For all my S.H.I.E.L.D. siblings. Family... And honor. That's what it means to be one of us, girl. You know, saying it like that... I lost my family, too. I'd like to join the Companions, so... Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting her. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your Vasker for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Not sure it's a fire so much anymore, but... But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Good. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, girl? Well, I can certainly handle myself, but I'm a bit rusty around the edges. Age tends to do that, as you probably know. That's the spirit. Vilkas here will get started on that. Vilkas, take her out to the yard and see what she can do. Aye. 
You don't sound very enthusiastic, Vilkas. Alright. May not sound it, but here we go. Sorry about that. Not here. Out in the yard. Come on. I'm <laughs> lead the way. Can't quite keep up with you. Did he really just <laughs> Yeah. He goes. You're new here. The old man I don't trust to have a look at you. So, let's do this. Just have a few swings at me so I can see I'm your fall. Oh, that's fine. All right. I can take her. Looks slow to me. Sorry, I was just trying to catch my breath. You run like a man with a mission. Pretty good arm you have there. Don't just stand there. All right, come on. You can swing back, I think. Not bad. Not bad. Not Looks bad. like your friends agree with me. Not bad. Not bad. Next time won't be so easy. <laughs> you might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorlin to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Will do. That's a great way to make a first impression. Yorlin is up on top of the hill, right? I would assume. I did not know that he was the... The blacksmith for the companions. Another grey hair. What brings you here? I suppose I should have expected as much. Vilka sent me with his sword. It needs to be sharpened, I think. I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. That didn't take long. Does Vilkas always send newcomers on errands? Or is it just me? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. Somebody has to be in charge, though. Are you a companion? Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge. Best steel in all of Skyrim. All of Tamriel. Well, it is an honor to meet you. I've met your wife. I will need to be going. I have a favor to ask. What is it? I've been working on a shield for Aella. My wife is in mourning and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aella for me. I'm happy to lend a hand. Get out of this rain. Well done. <laughs> it's a pretty nice forge you've got here. I'm sure that's an understatement, but yeah. I wonder if he knows. I wonder if he knows that um, that his son is safe. Ugh, who knows? And now I have to find Ayla. Who is that? Hello. When the Empire surrendered to the Aldmeri Dominion, 
We Greymanes have been feuding with the Battleborns for years. There's no more bitter enemy than an old friend. You're a Greymane then. I was done talking anyway. Alright. Interesting. It's a nice sword. Okay, let's go find Ayala. It's not her. Excuse me, are you? Need something? Are you Ayla? Farewell. No. Make it quick. And you're not Ayla either, I'm sure. Neither of them use shields anyway. Doesn't look like. Yeah. You're a talkative one, aren't you? What makes you say that? <clears throat> Just ran into him. Didn't even say anything. Uh, Tilma. What are you doing that for? D sorry, I'm looking for Ayala. Do you know where she is? Never mind. Thank you. Uh. Sorry to interrupt. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Huh, well, I have your shield. <laughs> and ah, neither of those good. things. I've been waiting for this. Are you new here? I told you. This is the whelp that Vilkis mentioned. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? Hmm. <laughs> I don't care much for boasting. And he has speed. Ah, a woman who lets her actions speak for her. I knew there was something I liked about you. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Ice Brain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, hello. I'm Farkas. Come, follow me. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't seen your face before. I'm watching you. Yeah. You're an I'm sure everyone needs me. But they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. Iskamore himself wouldn't nice have the patience to, to deal with all the rabble around here. Yeah, no kidding. Sometimes. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. Well, I survived everything Nerna's thrown at me so the far. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Tilma will keep the place clean. She always has. I might just take All you up right, on that. So here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. <laughs> Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. Of course. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've got trouble right here in Whiterun Hold. Nothing we can't handle. What kind of trouble should I expect? Like, uh, beating up a bard or...? Rogue wizards. I've never trusted magic types. The college is bad enough. Destroy them. That I can do. I will take care of it. I knew you could be counted on. Do what must be done. Will do. And Vilkis thought I was the talkative one. Right. I'm still trying to figure out why Skior let you in in the first place. If the Circle vouches for you, I'm sworn to respect their judgment. But that doesn't mean I like it. Well, neither of us have to like it. Why did you join the Companions? So I wouldn't have to answer stupid questions from idiots. I see. Mm -hmm. Don't get in my way, we won't I have a problem. I companion until you came along. I guess that's okay. Just means I can show you the ropes. That's the spirit, I think. <laughs>